For our next question, we'll use the crisscross method. We want to think of two numbers that multiply to 3. Those will likely be 3 and 1. And we want to think of two numbers that multiply to 2. Those will likely be, well, let's say 1 and 2. If I crisscross here, 3 times 2 is 7. 1 times 1 is 1. Or sorry, 3 times 2 is 6. Whoops. 1 times 1 is 1. When I add these up, I get 7. Well, I wanted to get 5. So I have to try uh, a different um, second column. Let's try 3 and 1, still in the first. Uh, instead of 1 and 2, we'll try 2 and 1. 3 times 1 is 3. 1 times 2 is 2. 2 plus 3 is 5. I wanted it to be 5. Well, since I got what I wanted, I can now read directly across. The first factor is 3x plus 2, second factor is 1x plus 1. Sorry, I accidentally crossed that out, but I didn't mean to do that. 3x plus 2 times x plus 1.